I started the organization when I was bored and uh, overweight and I missed my derby friends and I missed roller skating. I had tried a whole lot of other workouts and they were boring. It started with 13 women on November 13th of 2007. That was our very first class ever. And uh, it just really has grown from there. Well, it's actually not roller derby. Our classes are a fitness-based roller skating workout, which means that anybody can do it. We take women who have never skated in their lives, or maybe not since an eighth grade birthday party, you know, 30 years ago, and we teach them how to roller skate. And then along the way, they become better skaters and they become more physically fit. And probably any minute now, all these women who are gathering are gonna start hitting the floor behind me because every practice starts with walking. And then we start using um, the types of muscles and um, movements that we will ultimately be using in the class. After the warm-up off-skates period, then we bring, everybody has a chance to get their gear on, they go on out and they skate for a couple of minutes, just sort of free skating. I call that finding your skater legs because it's like getting on a boat. You know how you feel a little like weird at first when you get on a boat and after a couple of minutes you're fine, you found your sea legs. And that's kind of the same with skating. Um, we use what are called quad speed skates. They are the old school four on the floor, urethane wheels in a low cut boot. Um, this is a skate that has been adapted from speed skating. So it's a quad speed skate that most of our participants start in. I think that roller derby is a sport that um, has longevity. It's been around since the 1930s. There are always um, people who love to roller skate. It's a female dominated sport. So the idea that any woman of any size can do this sport is very appealing. And once they get started and you start seeing the the talent and the strength and the speed and the strategy of this game and the women who play this game, it's really amazing. And I think that's part of the appeal is that what people sort of come for the spectacle because it's like, oh, what's this? Women in pushnets playing a sport and knocking each other down. But once you actually see the game and when people become fans, they come every single time because it's just so, it's such a great experience. Kids love it and women love it and men love it and old people and young people, it really is a sport for everybody.